Hey guys, so I wanted to welcome you to our first walkthrough Wednesday. This is at our Down East Realty and Custom Homes lot here in Newber, North Carolina. And we have a beautiful home to show you today. We have the Summit Saddle, and it is the only place in North Carolina that you can actually walk through this home. So we want you to come on in, we'll do a tour virtually, but we do want you to show up and take a look at this home in person because it cannot be beat. So come on in. All right guys, so now that we're inside this Summit Saddle, we want to show you this great room. Now this great room includes your living room, kitchen, and dining room all in one, but we want to take a walk through. We'll walk through our dining room first, and then we'll take a look at our kitchen and laundry room. So this dining room is a really spacious dining room. You have enough, to, you have enough room to put a probably six seater or eight seater table. It is just great space for Christmas and, and family functions of having everybody over. So moving right along into the kitchen, we have a two-toned kitchen. We have a white kitchen cabinet uh, on the uh, exterior walls, and then we also have a gray kitchen cabinet in the island. Now, uh, all of these cabinets are soft closed doors and drawers. So this is a new feature in this home, and we just, we're the only ones that have it. So it's really, really nice. We also have the new black stainless steel appliances. We have a flat top range and we have a built-in microwave right above the range. So if we move on this way, we have a black stainless steel farmhouse sink, also a black stainless steel dishwasher. And this kitchen is just gorgeous. I can't get over the fact on how beautiful this kitchen is. You have a bar here with a couple stools you can set up just for family breakfasts in the morning. We have a ton of fluorescent light, oh, I'm sorry, can lights in these homes. It is just fantastic, cannot beat it. So we're gonna take a step, the refrigerator's kind of tucked away back here. We're gonna take a step into the laundry room. And we have a great space for your washer and dryer. We also have a deep sink. We also have some cabinets above the washer and dryer area as well. Also, I love that they put a pole in between, so if you're like me, I don't dry my clothes right away, so I hang them the first time. So that's where it's the perfect place for that. We also have another closet down here as well. So this laundry room is just perfect for a family. And also you can add on a garage because this is an exit as well. So I won't show you that, but we'll move on right into the living room and I'll meet you there. All right, so as we're moving out of the laundry room, we have all of these cabinets built in right around the refrigerator. It's perfect for your pantry. You have plenty of space. So walking back through this gorgeous, gorgeous, I call it a chef's kitchen, but that's just how I think. So if we come on this way, we'll show you this living room and how much space is in it. We have set up in here right now, a very large sectional. So it can seat about probably five or six people. There's also a third entrance and exit to this house so you can add on a back deck or patio really easily in this home. So if we come on over here, I'll show you, we have some built-ins right underneath our TV. It's perfect for games and, and, and stuff to store, just extra storage for you. And also these cabinets underneath here are soft clothes as well. We also have a place to put in a TV. It already is mounted. We have thought about everything in this house. It is just perfect. So also over here, just to show you how big this living room is, this is an actual little seating nook we, we created. It can be done for reading. It can be done just to sit and drink your morning coffee, looking out onto the porch whenever it's these hot summer days and you don't want to sit outside, but you still want to look outside. As we come this way, we will show you our upstairs. Now this house, as you saw at the beginning, has a full upstairs. It runs the length of the whole home. It is unfinished, but we can finish that for you. So as we go upstairs, I do want to take a quick snippet and show you how massive this upstairs is. So follow me up here. All right, guys, so welcome to our full unfinished upstairs in this home. We have a 912 roof pitch on this house. If you were to finish this, it adds about 1,100 square feet to your home and we can do that for you. Everything can be done on site and we can customize it to just how you like it. As we walk past, I just wanna show these dormers looking out onto the road right here at our dealership, but it is perfect if you put a little window seat underneath it for your kids' rooms, or if you just have this whole area wide open for a game room. So whenever the kids get a little rowdy, you can say, look, you need to go upstairs. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you how massive this room is. And this isn't even all. 
So as we turn back around, I know there's nothing up here to look at, but there's also easily can be done a bedroom right here. So you can easily put a wall up right here and add just one extra bedroom up here, which would make this house a four bedroom. And you can add a bath up here as well. So quick show you right here, we have our plumbing already ran through the ceiling. So it's a really, really easy fix for us and for you if you decide to do it down the road. So let's go back downstairs, take a look at the other bedrooms and the master. All right, guys, so now that we're back from upstairs, we're coming right off of the great room, going into the other side of the home, looking at the two bathrooms. But one thing I wanted to point out that I didn't before is I'm six foot tall, raising my hand, and this house is nine foot ceilings throughout. It is smooth ceilings as well, so it just makes it feel so much bigger so much bigger even though this house is already massive it makes it feel even bigger and as we come through the hallway i wanted to point out that in the great room and in through the hallway into the bathroom we have this luxury vinyl plank it is not peel and stick it is not um, linoleum it is a beautiful product and it is made by shaw it is fantastic for a home especially if you have pets so if we're coming into here i wanted to take a look at the second bath there's quite a few features i wanted to point out in here, we do have a one piece fiberglass shower tub combo. But one thing that this house offers that a lot of others don't is we do have the rubbed oil bronze fixtures and we also have it on the vanity as well. We also have it on the hardware in the vanity. Now these doors and drawers in this vanity are soft closed. So whenever you have kids and they're trying to slam the door shut, it just won't let them. <laughs> so as we come in, I wanted to show you one of the bedrooms now, as we walk into the bedroom, this is a five panel door. It's called our five panel farmhouse door. And we've added it in this home just as an additional feature, just to add some character to the home. In these new homes, a lot of character isn't added, but we wanted to add as much character as possible. So if we come on into the, one of the second bedrooms, there's three bedrooms in this house. We do have a lot of different options on this house. Now, I know that this is a lot to take in, but in the Summit series, we have quite a few different ways you can build this home. Now, of course, this is a custom built home, so we can kind of customize it however you like, but they have come up with some really great floor plans. I will point out one that's one of my favorites is this right here, where you can add on a second, add on a whole other box back here, and you can stick your kitchen and have a morning room and everything like that. It's just so many different front elevations and so many different variations of this home that they've come up with. They've done a really fantastic job in building this home. So as we're walking through, we do have a ton of natural light and also that the ceilings continue throughout this as well. And also coming through here, we do have a lot of different floor plans. And as you can kind of see a lot of different fixtures and stuff that you could add, you really can customize this home just as beautiful as you want to. You can make it yours. It doesn't have to look just like ours here on the lot. There's a lot of different options in that. So follow me, we'll go into the master and it is perfect. All right guys, so we're at the other end of the house. We're right off of the kitchen and we're gonna show you the master. And I wanted to keep this a surprise because it's the best part of the whole house. As we come in, I wanted to show you, we have a ton of natural light from these two windows and we have a really beautiful master. It has a ton of space. We have a smaller bed in here now, but it really can fit a really nice size bed with two nightstands. As you can see on either side of the nightstand, there's still plenty of space. So we can really push this out and make it a really nice size. One of my favorite features about this is this barn door. Now, a lot of places have barn doors and that's fine. But these are solid wood, soft, closed, and opening barn doors. Watch this. And look at this. So when your kids come in here, they can't get hurt because it's soft closed. It won't fall off the rails. But as I open that, it opens into this beautiful master ensuite. And this shower is, I, I can't tell you how much I love this shower. We have the tile that looks like white marble and it is beautiful we have the inset as well on the ribbon around the tile with the glass inset and it is beautiful as well we have the rub old bronze fixtures and we also have as you just saw a transom window and an amazon rain head as you know looking over the shower you have two ways you could use the water in this home now looking into this i've never seen so many cabinets in a master bedroom <laughs> but we have cabinets here for your linens we also have cabinets underneath for all your storage needs 
We also have these beautiful faucets that just are just really, really elegant. You also have a separate water closet for this home. So, and we even did the um, door, I'll get out of the way, sorry. <laughs> we even did the door, the five panel door in the bathroom as well. And it just makes it look so clean and crisp and beautiful in this home. This tile floor is really, really beautiful. We have the, um, it is the, I think it's LVT, Lowe's Revival Tile. So it's the same thing that's out here pretty much, but it's just a tile version. And as we want to go, I want to finish up this video real quick into the great room, looking at the kitchen again, because I just can't stop looking at it. So follow me. As we come in, just to show you, this is a massive bar. It is a great centerpiece of this home. And like I said before, guys, we're the only dealership in North Carolina that you can look through this home. This home is bar none, the most beautiful home we have on all four of our dealerships. I just can't get over it. And all the other homes might be jealous, but they're just gonna have to get over it. <laughs> so just to go over a quick little bit of information, this is our Summit Saddle. We're in New Bern, North Carolina at Downey's Realty and Custom Homes. Just like always, we'll have our phone number listed right here. Come see Mike, Cameron, Bob, they are salespeople here. They will take great, great, great care of you. We are a design center. So that means that this place can take any home that you see out here and we can design it just how you like it. We can customize anything that you see and we really want you to give us a chance. So give us a call. We really want you to come take a look at this in person and meet the team here in Newburgh. So I'll see you next time. This was our walkthrough Wednesday and it was great being with you. All right guys, so one second, right before we, I wanted to finish this video up, I wanted to introduce you to one of our salesmen here in New Bern. This is Mike Thomas, and he wanted to tell you just a few more things about this house. I'll let him take over. Hey everyone, I just wanted to add to what Austin has been uh, uh, filming. Uh, it's very important on, on structural. It starts with a good foundation and, and the build goes all the way through to the roof. We're standing in the upstairs now. I wanted to point out that on our houses, our off-road mods, it's not traditional like a site-built home with a two-by-four uh, roof truss. It is a two-by-six, which goes along with your two-by-six walls. Also, you get two-by-ten floor joists on 16-inch centers, plus your ceiling for your upstairs is also a two-by-ten on 16-inch centers. So it's very important. I wanted to point that out to you guys, and I want to invite everybody to come in and look at these beautiful homes.